A family traveling through central Georgia had all of their belongings stolen overnight at a Macon hotel. Molly Jeb visited the parking lot and tells us more about what happened. The family of five were on their way to Alabama from Florida when they stopped in Macon Monday night around 9. Then sometime before 6 Tuesday morning, someone stole their U-Haul truck from this Marriott Hotel's parking lot. Monday night, Kathleen Carney and her three girls and husband stopped to sleep at the Marriott on Coliseum Drive in Macon. It seemed nice. The parking lot was lit. They had only stopped for the night and were getting ready to leave and drive the last five hours of their trip to their next home. We are on the seventh floor. We looked out the window and our truck was gone. We were shocked and my first thought was, well, maybe the hotel had it towed. I mean, I couldn't imagine someone actually stealing our truck. In less than 12 hours, someone stole more than $10,000 worth of their belongings, new furniture, appliances, a piano, clothes, the girl's Christmas presents, and more were all gone. I saved their like hospital bracelets, so it's just stuff like that. Well, I'll never get that stuff back, you know, like handprints and yeah, <laughs> I don't want to think about it because it's really just Carney says they filed a report with the Bibb Sheriff's Office, but doubt they'll ever see their belongings again. I wanted to just put it out there to let people know that, yeah, it does happen. It happened to us. Now, we've seen this before. There was a family moving to Savannah this past summer when they had their U-Haul truck stolen in Macon. And then this time last year, there was a man moving to Florida when he had nearly all of his belongings stolen, too. In Macon, Molly Jett, 13 W MAZ News. Sheriff's Office cannot give more details on the case to see the family's GoFundMe page. Look for this story at 13WMAC.com.